Please use star code Aquila when buying Robux or Premium. These are all of my social media accounts. Enjoy the video! Hi everyone, it's Aquila. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And as you probably have heard, Grandma Annie is currently in the hospital. But the good thing is that she's in really good hands and she should be released soon. But I've been doing a lot of thinking and I don't know if it's the best idea for her to be living alone at this age. I mean, I don't want a repeat of what happened last time and she ends up in the hospital or worse. So I was doing some talking with August and the kids and we think it would be best if she stayed with us for a while. And I mean, as you know, all the rooms were taken, so I had to do a bit of renovating to the house. So this hallway has been extended and we now have two spare rooms. There's this one over here, which we can take a look at. And then we have the room that's right next door. I do like the way that the sunlight shines into this room a bit better. And you can also see the town from here. So I think we're probably going to turn this room into the guest room slash Grandma Annie's room. But I'm not exactly sure what we should do with this room. I mean, I feel like an arts and crafts room would be fun. But let me know if you guys have any ideas. I would really, really appreciate that. But okay, so let's go ahead and figure out where we're gonna place everything down. So we have this little area right here and maybe we can have a bookshelf and maybe a chair, but I feel like that'd be nice by the window too. So I'm not exactly sure what we could do over here. Maybe a dresser? Cause we definitely have to have a dresser in here. And then the bed could be up against this. Ooh, I don't know because I feel like waking up to the sunlight would be a lot better. So maybe we can have the bed against this wall, the dresser over here, and then we can have like the reading area because Grandma Annie loves to read. That section can be right in this little part with the table and everything. Yeah, we could definitely make this work. So let's go ahead and get started.
finally finished decorating Grandma Annie's room, so let's go ahead and take a look. When you first walk in, there's a dresser behind the door with a TV on it, and it's pretty small. And then on the ground below that, there's a laundry hamper, so she can just throw all her laundry in there. And I could just come and take it and wash it for her and then bring it back. There's a quote on the wall, and then there's a few vanity items and then we have a mirror. Behind the mirror, there are a few vines just for a little extra detail. And then we have this floor plant, which looks really nice. Here is where her bed is. Next to her bed, she has a nightstand with some books, a lamp, some tissues, the remote for the TV, and below that, there's a little teddy bear. Again, this is what her bed looks like. And on the opposite side, there's another clothing rack just for extra storage. And below that, there are some boxes. I thought having this little bench by the window would be nice so she could sit here if she wanted to as well. And the last area of the room is like the reading corner. So we have a really cozy sofa chair. There's another table with an open book and some books below that too. Then there's a vase on the floor. There's a heart balloon. And the final piece of furniture that we have is the shelf in the back. We have the usual items that I would place on the shelf. Some books, a candle, a heart sculpture. But my favorite is definitely this picture of Grandma Annie when she was younger. Grandpa Lewis. And believe it or not, that's me. I guess my style hasn't changed much, but I really hope you enjoyed watching this video. Let me know what you think of Grandma Annie's new room, and if you want to see a routine with her while she's here. Also, if you have any ideas on what I should do for the other spare room, let me know. Should I make it an arts and crafts room or something else? And do not forget to leave a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below. Once you are subscribed, click the bell button so you get notified whenever I post a video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye! You, you've been hiding in the shadows way too long. Always thought that you were weak, but babe, you're wrong.